Hi, my name is Pamela Gatto and I'm the program coordinator of the simulation lab at London Valves. What makes it so interesting? The fact that it is the place where we can try the real experience of simulation-based learning, essentially in three steps, observing, sharing and practicing. In other words, it's a way to fill the gap between slides and real cases. So hope to see you all in London. Bye, ciao. By joining us live online, you will feel part of London Valves 2022, no matter what time of day it is or where in the world you're watching from. Specifically, you will receive exclusive content, bringing you right up to speed with the latest in late-breaking clinical trial data, the key learnings from the simulation-based sessions, and the most important insights from the aortic, mitral, and tricuspid tracts. And lastly, you will have the opportunity to interact live with real-time chat to connect you to some of the key opinion leaders and pioneers at the cutting edge of transcatheter valvular intervention. So join us at PCR Live from London Valves. Uh, we uh, collaborated with a core group uh, made by cardiac surgeon Volkmar Fork and Henrik Trider, interventional cardiologist Tiffany Patelson and myself, and emerging specialists Nina Vundolich and uh, Victoria Delgado. Now, this year we introduced the concept of the Innovation Hub. It's a free flow room where you will be able to see startup and early feasibility trial devices. Uh, for the first time, you will be able to talk to the experts, to the engineers, to see these devices, maybe touch them, understand how they work on simulators, on specimens, so that you will be able to be ready for the revolution which will impact our practice in the next uh, 10 to 20 years. So don't miss the opportunity, come to London Valves in presence, enjoy this uh, innovation hub and uh, all our innovation activities because the future is coming very fast. This year edition is going to feature live cases from London, Copenhagen and Toulouse, as well as some recorded live cases from Bern and Mainz. So what you're going to get through these cases is daily challenges with currently uh, available uh, as structural heart disease devices, as well as innovation and a step-by-step -step description of key procedural steps, as well as interactivity as usual. So stay tuned and I hope to see you all in London. Bye-bye.